Hey, today we're going to be doing some nitinol wire experiments. Um, I have a spring and just some uh, nitinol wire. Uh, it's made of a titanium nickel alloy. Um, I'm not sure the exact properties of uh, the metal, but when it's uh, heated to high temperature, it can be formed into one shape. And then when it's uh, cooled off and then heated up in like 150 degree water or something, uh, like a lighter, uh, it will form back to that shape if it's been out of the shape that it was put in. So right now I have some hot water on my hot plate set about 180 degrees. So let me move the thermometer and turn off the stirrer. So let's start with a spring. As you can see, it's just normal spring. Um, and I'm just going to take it apart and just kind of mangle it. Uh, if you did this with any other spring, it would be gone. Um, there's a, it's pretty bad right there as you can see. So, put it in the water. As you can see, it snapped right back. Right back to normal. Now let's do it again just to show you guys because this is pretty cool. Uh, to me, at least. Uh, so there we go again. And you know what? I can just do it in a big long string. You can see, so I can just drop it in. It's about eight inches long, so here we go. You know what? Let's do that again so I can take a, I'll take out the, the stir bar. So, let me go on down here a little bit so you can see this hopefully. So again, I made it about eight inches long. So. so yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, now I'll just do uh, the wire. Um, I'm for this. I'm gonna take off the the beaker of boiling water. Um, because with the wire it can't expand properly inside the beaker. Um, let's see if I can get a reading on what the hot plate is. Um, see, it's about uh, it's at 140 and it's still raising. Um, so here it's just kind of bent into a like a spring shape. I'll just touch it right down. I don't know if you can see that flattening out or not. There it goes right back to normal. Um, I bent it in half so you can see it. But there it is in half and right back. So, yeah, that's pretty neat stuff. So, uh, if you have any questions, uh, let me know. Uh, thanks for watching.